Hi there, Monday again, so uh, here I am. I'm gonna check what the, the cards, star seeds are telling us about the week, okay? I just did the, um, the direct in Spanish for my group and the card that pop out is this, which is the card abundance. Interesting for the week. Now, why is this popping in now? I'm just gonna read you the, the card, the poem that introduces the card. It says, I liberate myself, <clears throat> I am everything, I feel rich, I feel essence of everything, everything consumes me, everything includes me, they feel me, I feel them, I am everywhere and I'm one. This is actually abundance. And if you see the card, you connect it to heaven and earth. You're like a bridge. Now, it means that this week, you, if you have done the homework, basically you feel a transformation in the way you receive on a physical level, on an emotional level, on a mental level, on a spiritual level. Why? Because you have put the seeds, you have nurtured them, meaning you have done the inner work, and now you are receiving everything you have put up there. Personal work, service, everything, okay? So, finally, as when you've been nurturing a plant and, and putting the watering it and, uh, and checking the soil and the vitamins and everything, this is the same. Now you're getting the fruit, the result, okay? Meaning, if before now you were unable to receive, it's because something was not working in the part of you opening to receive. Now you have changed something, and this allows you to receive with an open heart. This is the difference, okay? So, you feel uh, a deep, unconditional love and you flow with life. Instead of resisting and controlling or complaining, you do the other way, okay? Now, the image that we have here, which I painted many years ago, actually between uh, 93 and uh, 2002, those are channel images, it's about like the image of the perfect man of Leonardo da Vinci is about being connected to all the cardinal points, to the north, to the south, to the east, to the west, to everything, to the night, to the day, to heaven, to earth. And you are the sun, you are your sun, meaning you are queen in your kingdom or you are king in your kingdom. Finally, you have found your life. You're a beacon of light for you and for the others. This is the energy of the week, okay? Now, it means that in a way you found your world, the place you need to be, okay? This is very, very important. Now, the other thing is that you have accepted your power which is so, so important. And the responsibility that it has owning your power. Because maybe before you were doing transference of giving your power away to other people that you felt they were more powerful or connected than you, okay? So by finding your word, you expand your world, your universe from your center, and it's like your mission, it's revealed. Now, for those who have problems with abundance, it's about this week revising your way of receiving and giving. This is my, my recommendation in a general way. Uh, check the way you open yourself to receive. Check your belief system. 
maybe there's something that you you need to release that it's not serving you anymore check expectations which are not serving you either because if you have expectations you're not flowing with it check everything and make a list and see how you feel about it family life if you have a partner work-wise spiritually general because we have so many boxes in many aspects and it's about not being in a box being everything and being nothing <laughs> maybe paradoxically but it's it's like that so for today is a very short one i'll try to do something on friday if i can before we finish this month because it's october and on Sunday we finish and then it's the 1st of November. Actually on the weekend I cannot do any, any Facebook Live because I'm giving a workshop for three days, a sound healing workshop with uh, Crystal Sound and, and some important points that are windows to the soul to actually uh, connect you with uh, your own higher self. And it's something I'm sharing with the students that are coming on this weekend. So uh, for those that are watching me later, I know that nobody is connected now. It doesn't matter. Um, just let me know how you receive things in your life. Share with me what's the way for you right now to receive. What have changed in these two years? And uh, what do you think that you can change? And we will keep talking over the week. So, big kiss to everybody and see you soon.